Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, Bobby Stroh 444. This is going to be another love collective message here for all 12 zodiac signs. Today is April 27th. Happy Wednesday to you all. So uh, let's get started and get these messages out here. This is the good, the bad, and the ugly. I cannot guarantee what's going to come out. That last reading I just did was a uh, very disturbing so i'm hoping that we get some better energy out of here some better messages for you so only take what resonates from these and leave the rest okay if it does not fit your story your situation do not force these messages to fit okay let's get started i keep hearing we didn't start the fire it was always burning since the world's been turning so somebody trying to fight off a fire here Oh, let's see what's going on, Collective. What's going on? Somebody got a fire under their rear? All right. Oh, so fake the death to escape. So somebody's faking a death. Well, this could be an ego death. It doesn't have to be a physical death. But it could be. We have big money moves, okay? Somebody could have done this just to make big money moves. Clout, status, okay? Whatever they can get out of this situation. Money. I want to have a family with you. So somebody wants to have a family with you. If they don't have a family with you, maybe they're trying to escape uh, to get out of a situation and make these big money moves so they can have a family with you. Okay, it says on another level. So somebody wants some steamy sex here. So you, you could be on a break with this person right now or is taking a break here. Somebody wants to take a break to get away, but you're on another level here. we got suicidal ideation. So somebody may have some mental health issues here and you know me mental health issues they're not funny it's very serious so uh please get some help reach out to someone um there are 1-800 uh numbers out there to help you with the suicide hotline please uh try and reach out to someone because there's no reason to want to do that to yourself because you're stuck in a situation okay want to harm yourself all right, so we have stop pressuring me right now. So somebody thinks that they're being pressured. Okay, feel like they're overwhelmed or they're heavily burdened here. Seeing the light. So somebody could be seeing the light now, taking the blindfold off. They're avoiding judgment. Don't want to be judged for whatever they've done here. If it was escaping a death or, or these suicidal ideations, I don't know, or it was just some steamy sex in order to get some big money moves. All right, so we have inappropriate behaviors that could i mean could be due to some sex to make some big move, money moves here moves moo i don't know cow's milk could be significant to somebody out there or just cows in general we have um <laughs> irresistible so collective you're over here being irresistible simply irresistible she's so fine there's no telling where the money went so there's no telling where the money went because she's irresistible or he's irresistible. It says, you make my heart melt. So this person is said, yeah, it's a lesson. Learn and moved on. You, you have moved on. Most of you have. Okay. If not, maybe you need to move on. It's saying the accident here. So be, uh, be careful because there could be a, a vehicle accident. Somebody could actually, it could be an accidental suicide. I don't know. It's going to be different for all of you here. It could be due to inappropriate behavior. Somebody just act not, uh, not themselves, not Somebody's like broken down. We got bankruptcy it could be um, significant. Regretful they stole money from you. So somebody could be going through bankruptcy or bankruptcy court here. Check out that last reading. Like I said, the energy was very heavy there, but this this could have been an accident to go bankrupt. Or uh, I don't see that, but okay. You, we have so much in common. Refuse to tell all the good things you've done for them because uh, you know they're talking bad about you or somebody else here. Yeah, you have so much in common. Maybe you do have something in common with this person or a lot of things in common. I don't know. Water sign and fire sign and cahoots together. So there's that Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. And not to say anything against them, but um, Cancer has been really heavy this morning. So something's going on with the Cancerian. And there's 7 billion people on this planet. So who's to say which Cancerian it is? I don't know. Okay. Take it as it resonates. But Aries, Leo, Sag, and Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio in uh, cahoots together. We got um, October could be significant or something could have happened in October. Something may be happening this October. The number 10 could be significant to you. Okay, if he's 10-10, could be a Libra or could be just the justice system going with a big money moves. And now this person's bankrupt, but they're avoiding judgment. 
due to inappropriate or reckless behaviors here. It says you are so good to me. So you are so beautiful to me. Can't you see? Somebody needs to surrender. Okay. We got forced coercion. So somebody being coerced again. I, I, the cue cards keep coming up. I keep seeing cue cards like somebody's read this, say this. Now do this. Unable to meet your needs. So this person's unable to meet your needs or was unable to meet your needs at the time. I don't know. So we got, I pretend that I'm okay, but I'm not. So somebody's not okay. And it's okay not to be okay, but also recognizing there's a problem and reaching out and getting help. Okay. We have reapers. So somebody's reaping what they're sowing right now. Okay. Going through some karma. They don't want you or anything to do with you. So somebody don't want you or don't want anything to do with you. Okay. They just want you for big money moves. Take your money. Catfish. That one came out before. Spiritual lesson. This could be a spiritual lesson. Somebody making these big money, money moves kept by catfishing. I don't know why this energy is coming out today here. We got the past is haunting this person. This person could be stuck in their head, being haunted by their by their demons from the past. Okay, what the wrongdoings that they've done. They're still dealing with their ex. Could be, you know, involved in this catfishing. Or it could be a person that does catfish. I don't know. We have unbreakable bond. A spiritual lesson wanted to come out. Lesson and move on, okay? Somebody's got a lot of hesitation right now. They're scared. Okay, fear is an illusion. Can I, can't get no satisfaction. So this person can't get satisfied. All right? Well, nothing satisfies them. It doesn't matter how much money you have. It doesn't matter how much status you have. It doesn't matter how much clout you have. It doesn't matter how much... Um, love that you have for this person because they can't get no satisfaction. They're never going to be able to. It's never going to be enough. So we got blonde hair. Could be significant. Somebody got blonde hair over there. Male or female. What is this? Two-faced. Is it this two-faced blonde haired person? Male or female? Somebody two-faced around you? All right. So we have, yeah, uh, pleasure, uh, pleasuring. Somebody could be pleasuring right now. Somebody that's two-faced with blonde hair. Okay, uh, releasing old patterns and behaviors here. Somebody made a big mistake, okay? Not messing with the collective, so you, you messed with the wrong one, that's for sure. Walk in the park. Somebody thought you were going to be a walk in the park collective. I thought you was going to be easy. It was going to be easy street that they was going to be able to catfish you or take your money, okay, or steal from you or to make these big money moves here. We have Monday could be significant. Somebody's unattracted or unattractive or this is just literally unattractive all this scheming waiting for a message or a phone call text letter communication so somebody's waiting for been waiting for a girl like you to come into my life yeah they're waiting male or female sudden or traumatic event that could be an accident i'm getting a car vehicle accident Driving, driving into water or something. Please get somebody some help over here if you know this is going on. Because nobody deserves this. Everyone deserves to be loved and cared for. And this is, this is sad. Somebody really doesn't love themselves at all here. They're disgusted with their life. It's like day and night. I'm all alone. And so somebody's all alone day and night. You're the real deal over here. They're looking for their next target. I'm about to get emotional over here. This is sad. It's really heavy. Why would you still want me after all that I said and done? We've got a Virgo that could be involved. Somebody's tangled up in this web. All right. That they created. They're in isolation. Okay, or somebody's being isolated or feeling like they're isolated. Maybe they don't have friends or family, anybody around them right now. They're trying to avoid being judged. They're hiding. Okay, um, you're, somebody's mocking you. Okay, uh, they're probably mocking me too, and that's all right. It is what it is. We have second chance. So somebody wants a second chance over here. Could be this Virgo. I don't know. That's the only uh, sign that's come out. Yeah, it's like day and night, Jekyll and Hyde over here. Okay, sunrise or sunset could be significant. This could be like yin and yang too. 
Okay, I want you to choose me. So it's like, pick me, choose me, pick me. So somebody's over there doing that, like uh, you're back in grade school, you know, and getting picked to play on the team, right? Physical abuse. So there's physical abuse here involved. This is sad. Never thought, yeah, they thought they would never get caught. This person thought they was never going to get caught. They're in denial right now and they're facing judgment. They're trying, they're avoiding it, but there's no running away from karma. You know, what you, uh, what goes around comes around. So if this is what you're putting out there, that that's what you want, then you got to pay the consequences here. It's like you got to rob Peter to pay Paul from what I'm hearing. So somebody's robbing Peter to pay Paul. Borrowing from one to pay another that they owe. Hopeless. So somebody's hopeless. They're got a lot of passion here for you, collective. They're saying this went too far and they're missing the old you. Because, you know, you change, you're different. You're not, you're not able to be manipulated or not easily manipulated. Okay, someone has a smear your name campaign, you know, because they ain't got no... They got nothing better to do with their life than to mess around with somebody else's life. Move around, right? Do something else. Like, go to work. Go pay your bills. Do something other than mess around with somebody else's life. If they've done moved on, leave them alone. Let them live their life. They miss the way you look at them, okay? We got snake bite love over here, so somebody's getting bit or stuck in a snake pit. Or they keep going back and getting bit by a snake. I don't know. Yeah, this person hates you because they don't love themselves. They see something in you that they don't have. If it's confidence, they don't have confidence. So they hate you because you got confidence. If it's you're strong, you've got strengths, that you love yourself, they hate that because they don't love themselves. Oh, they don't want to see you happy together. They make too many wrong decisions. So somebody's making way too many wrong decisions and getting caught up over there. Breaking in. So somebody may want to break in or somebody's trying to break in to make these big money moves. So just be aware. Make sure that you have cameras set up. If if you do already, check your cameras here. Okay? Because um, someone's trying to break in. Whether it's a, ho a house or it is uh, related to your bank accounts or any type of... Uh, money or business that you have here going on they're tired of running they just want to conquer you and they can't conquer you they can't they can't um get you to do what you they want you to do substance abuse over here so somebody's dealing with substance abuse that could be why they're having suicidal ideations because they can't handle what's going on in their life there's towers crashing down like the there's like a fire down below there's a fire down below. They got one thing in common. It's a fire down below. So both of them have a fire down below. Whoever this person is dealing with or whoever you're dealing with, okay? Can I come over? Somebody's like, can I come over and see you? Come on over. Come on over, baby. Yeah. Sagittarius, maybe. I don't know. Or Virgo. We got obstacles. Yeah, because there's tower moments. They can't move. They got towers. They under fire. All right, look at your pictures and social media. And we got an impersonator over here. Someone trying to be you, trying to act like you, trying to do the same things that you do. Because they ain't got time with their own life. They want to mess around with somebody else's life. Move around. Go pay your bills. Go to work. Stop worrying about somebody else. I feel like somebody else, somebody here is like uh, taking breaks on somebody. Take a break, okay? It's like they're switching off to fuck up somebody's life. It's like, I'll take this shift, and then you can take this shift, and then you can take this shift. And then, you know, by three or four people working together, taking shifts in order to mess up somebody's life. Because they ain't got nothing better to do. They'll do anything, whatever it takes to get you back. Including messing up your life. Including impersonating you to try and steal from you. Unfit baby mama, baby daddy over here. Not taking care of their kids, neglecting their kids, um, indulging in substance abuse, making big money moods, stealing from you, having suicidal ideations, hesitating, being stuck, wanting a new beginning but can't. 
you're on a new beginning collective. This person needs some help. Acting single over there, okay? Player, energy. Somebody taking a risk or being very risky and foolish. Foolish be to their heart, okay? Should have told you how I really feel. So they made you an option and now you have options, collective. We got secret life. Yeah, so the secret of the life is there ain't no secret, right? Trafficking, somebody trafficking could be drugs, substance abuse over here. Does not have to be, okay? It's just here, so I have to mention it. There's trafficking being done. All right, we have traumatized. So somebody's traumatized now from what's going on in their life. Like I said, there's a fire down below where they're dealing with Jekyll and Hyde over here. It's like you're dealing with someone that has is a ticking time bomb. You don't know if you're going to press the wrong button and what's going to happen next, right? And you don't know when that timer is going to go off. Drunk on whiskey and getting risky, saying you left them so they don't feel guilty, so they're telling anybody, anybody and everybody that will listen, so they can, so somebody will feel bad for them. Oh, you poor thing! I can't believe they did that to you. Why would they do something like that? Why would they just up and leave you? Because all this stuff's going on. Who wants to be involved with all this stuff, right? This person's feeling lonely. It's Capricorn over here. This Virgo over here, I don't know. And we got an enemy. So you got an enemy around you. Because this person don't like you. Because they don't love themselves. They just don't care. You're on a new beginning over here, collective. Okay. Broke. And this person's broke. They're living on a prayer. They got these deep, dark secrets that are coming out. And they hate you. Oh, well. Uh, and they can't sleep because they're being haunted by their demons. All the net, all the negative and nasty things that they've done here, they're coming out. All right, and they can't handle it. They breadcrumbed you. A little bit here, a little bit there. Let's just put them on the shelf. If you keep them distracted, then we can go do this. Let's keep this person distracted. Let's put them up on the shelf and let them rest there for a little bit, and they'll never know, right? So, I mean, there could be third parties here involved. Somebody getting drunk and, and going, you know, girls gone wild or guys gone wild here, okay? Let's not, uh, let's, let's keep this woman or man thinking that we still are involved with them, but we're going to still go out and do this, right? Inappropriate behaviors. July could be significant. Something could have happened in July. Uh, a choice was made in July or, or maybe January here. Could be an Aquarius, it could be Capricorn or Cusp there, okay? Or it could be a Cancerian or a Leo Cusp dating, okay? So it may, may have been a choice to date, whether online dating or not, in July or in January here. We got falsified documents, so somebody signed your signature without permission, okay? And we got rehearsed. Yeah, somebody rehearsing. We'll take shifts over here, okay? We'll do it this shift. I'll do it this shift, and then you can do it this shift, and then you can do it this shift because I have to go to work. So they're rehearsing stuff, trying to get their story straight. We got rebellious, so yeah, <laughs> rebel without a cause. With a rebel, yeah, we cry mo, 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 right? In the midnight hour. <laughs> so they're doing stuff in the midnight hour over here, man. All right, we got Wednesday, so something could be significant. Today is Wednesday. Happy hump day, by the way. All right, we got Lucky Charm. You Lucky Charm over here, Collective. This person falsified some type of documents. It could have been uh, faking a death, okay? It could have been big money moves. It could have been something with your business if they stole from you here. And you may be finding this out today. Things moving too fast. Don't know how to trust how I feel. You know, maybe there was a prediction here. Somebody said, you know what? This is going to happen. Okay, or maybe somebody watched a reading or got a tarot reading here and made some type of prediction and now this person's going through it. Oh, yeah, I love money more than I love you. Trust here. Trust is broken. It's a big money moves. It's all about the money. Slept with him or her just recently. So someone slept with him or her just recently. Okay, and uh, they're intimidated by you. There's intimidation here. This person's addicted to your energy collective will lie to your face and smile, that habitual liar, that pathological liar. You can't trust this person. 
Yeah, a newborn. Okay, somebody could have just had a recently had a child or is about ready to have a child here and they could be involved. We have this relationship is over. You're playing it safe or this person maybe is playing it safe now. We got fake friends are involved here. You know, the fake friends will turn on your back. They'll lie to your face, lie to you and smile on your face. So keep an eye out for that. You know, that's a warning. Pay attention to the red flags. If you, if you know you can't trust them, don't trust them. Because once somebody shows you their true colors, they're not going to change. And the mask is coming off. Mask off. Mask off. Friends, yeah. Friends, but they're fake, okay? Spring, something could be happening this spring here. We are in spring season. Sexy and you know it. Collective over here, sexy and you know it. Somebody may be dealing with their ex. It don't have to be, but somebody's dealing with the devil. Dealing with a... Uh, it could be just a substance abuse. Getting to somebody's, you know, um, affecting someone's mentality. Like they're overindulging in, in these drugs or whatever they're doing here. Whatever substances they're using. And now they can't take it. It's like their head is spinning. They don't know what's real and they don't know what's fake. You are the only one for me. I don't want to be with anybody else is what they're saying. We got a gold digger over here. So somebody's a gold digger. Way over time. It digs on me. So somebody's digging on a gold digger. So you smell so sweet. It's a lesson, right? This person is not learning their lesson. They need a timeout. They go sit down a little bit and learn, okay? Maybe realize what you're doing here because if you have not gone to jail, you're most likely going to jail. Maybe this person already has a record. I don't know. You're the total package over here. This person may have hired a hitman, okay? Or the total package hired a hitman. I don't know. Safe and smart choices, so... I feel like you're over here making safe and smart choices. This person's studying you so they could be just like you. Yeah, because they hate you. Because they don't love themselves. So they want to be like you. They want to have strength like you. They want to have confidence like you. And they can do that for themselves. Not impersonate and be a different person. Or be that same person. Be yourself and do that. Bait and hook. So... <laughs> Stop blabbing to others about my past, okay? And I'm not going to do that because these messages need to be heard. So the past is coming out. The passion for you is intense because you are irresistible over here, collective. You're looking good. You're smelling good. Like sweet Caroline. Bum, bum, bum. Good times never seem so good. Yeah, good times, right? Read between the lines. Uh, all eyes is on you. So you read between the lines and all eyes are on you collective right now. Let's see. We got group sex was involved in some way, shape, or form here. Somebody's grouping it up. And uh, there's a baby here. So somebody's pregnant, a newborn here. Or um, some. if not, if there's no child involved, then somebody could just be reborn. Going through an ego death and waking up out of the matrix here. We got... Uh, photos and memories so somebody's reminiscing looking at your photos you know wishing and hoping and praying here it's playing on your fears what i say fear is an illusion would you believe it you feed into it that's an illusion there is no fear there's only love and we have i got a tarot reading on you yeah somebody got a tarot reading on you or somebody could be a tarot reader here i don't know natural disaster it could be that accident you know spontaneous something sudden that happens whether it is a vehicle accident it could be a fire like i said all right coping mechanisms over there indulging court justice somebody's dealing with the court system the bankruptcy possibly i don't know due to their big money moves or due to stealing some from somebody's business or stealing from you let's see what is this court justice they just want to kiss you all night they'll always choose you and uh, yeah just kiss me it's all about lust just uh thinking with their member insane in the membrane somebody's insane in the membrane over here yeah call someone who cares you're like give them a quarter a dime a nickel a penny yeah stole your inheritance so person stole your inheritance or is trying to steal your inheritance because they want these they want what you have they don't want to work for what 
they can have. They want what you have. Working it out. Somebody wants to work it out. Let's stay together. Somebody says, let's stay together. All that we've been through and all that we still can be, let's uh, give our love one more chance. This isn't love, my dears. This is criminal activity. We have karmic cycle. Okay, we got pull five cards from the karmic deck. So whether this is a soul connection here or it could be a twin flame or someone that you've seen as a soulmate or a twin flame. Okay, we don't have a whole lot of those out there, but take it as it resonates. This person could have got into uh, a connection or a relationship with a karmic individual. They do not have to, but they got stuck in a karmic cycle or you got stuck in a karmic cycle. So I'm going to pull some of those karmic decks. Uh, to see what's going on in this karmic bill over there in just a minute. You block communication. This person is blocked, and they're saying, don't look back, collective. Keep up, keep it moving, okay? Uh, love don't cost a thing. That's what you're saying over here. You got J-Lo moves. You got the J-Lo moves over here. My love don't cost a thing. Think you gotta keep me as you Think you're gonna spend my cash I want. Even if you were broke, my love don't cost a thing. Yep. Even if you were broke, love don't cost a thing. You can always make money. Not illegally, right? Huh. All right, let's see what's going on in this karmic bill. What do they need to know? What does the collective need to know about this karmic bill? What's going on? All right, you're being watched. Just so you know. I'm sure you already know that. I want you and them. Somebody wants to have their cake and eat it too. Living a secret life. So the secret of the life is there ain't no secrets, right? They're weak, so they choose less. Low, low self-esteem, low vibing, right? So they choose somebody that has low self-esteem, doesn't love their self, and is also in low vibration, right? Don't feel very good about what's going on with their lives. Unsatisfied, can never be satisfied. They're saying they don't know how to treat a king or a queen, so they go for peasants. A bunch of circus jugglers over there because now uh, shit's breaking down or there's fires going on here. Things are igniting, okay? People pushing buttons on other individuals, and they're, ju they're juggling too much. There's too many burdens. There's too much going on. Move around. All right, I don't know how to be independent. This person doesn't know how to be independent. They love codependency. They thrive on it. They have to have somebody around them all the time doing their work for them. Okay, all they do is think about you. So all they do is think about you, collective. They got prostitutes, a brothel, a cat house is going on over there. You know, sex uh, for money. That's how they're making it. She, uh, Yeah, he or she's threatening them. There's physical abuse over there. They're being threatened. Misery loves company. This is what you're saying over here. You know, who wants to be miserable? That's a choice. You choose that. You can choose to love. You can choose to be happy. Or you can choose destruction and misery. Which w would you rather choose? Yeah, acting out and arguing all day and night over there. You know, it's a fist fight fest, as I heard. So, so Jesus. Run, they're running because the past is catching up with them. Or they're trying to run. Like I said, they're faking a death to try and get out. Public humiliation. Somebody's being publicly humiliated. If they have not. And they're not currently being publicly humiliated. They will be in the near future. This will be happening here. Public humiliation. Okay, we got a distorted masculine over here. You know, in their head. In their head. Somebody feels like a zombie. All right. They may not get no sleep. Okay, getting rid of evidence. Somebody's trying to get rid of evidence because there was a sign falsified documents. Somebody signed your name to something. So they're trying to find the evidence to get rid of it. If they have not already, darkness will befall this person. If they keep uh, engaging in this illegal activity, they get, it's going down, it's going down, right? Trauma bonding. These persons trauma bonding. That's their things in common. Anxiety. Somebody's got heavy anxiety right now. Yeah, the karmic is neglecting their kids, not paying attention because they're too worried about what's going on with the collective here. You know, that they don't care what's going on with their own life. What's going on with their kids? Are their kids getting to school? Are they able to pack their lunches over here? I mean, are you reading to them at night? What are you not? You're not doing anything. All right. 
it is what it is and you just have to accept people for who they are but they also need to be reported if they're neglecting their kids if you're not feeding your kids you're not sending them off to school you're not helping them with their homework you're not reading to them or engaging in any type of activities with your children here then something wrong you're unfit karmic is draining my bank accounts this karmic is draining the bank accounts all right crabs are biting at the ankles over there and dealing with a bunch of crabs maybe somebody does have crabs i don't know uh karmic family and friends make me hate you yeah it's like the, you gotta hate her we don't like her or we don't like him just because i hate her you're gonna have to hate her or just because i hate him you're gonna have to hate him They're all in together getting a whole clan of people together maybe somebody's in a clan i don't know Wants you to fail because you left. Yeah, because I said they're taking, telling other people, anybody that will engage into their conversations, okay? Maybe they don't have a whole lot of friends now. Maybe people are starting to walk away from them. They're mad because you left them because you don't want nothing to do with this stuff. You don't want to be involved in this. Feeding off your energy because they're weak. So they're trying to pull on your energy because they're weak. They need it. You've got good energy, collective. Talk bad about you because they just want to be a part of your life. Because they're mad because you left. Because you don't want to be involved in all this stuff. All this illegal activity. Ew. <laughs> Family and narcissists. What the heck is going on? Yeah, it's selfishness. Whatever they can get. And that's what you attract. If you're a narcissist, you're going to attract a narcissist. No stability. Now this person has no stability because they got... Raped by a gold digger. They got taken. Like a fool. And now they're crying. We got angels and demons over here. Spiritual warfare. It's a spiritual lesson. Learn and move on. Trying to recover and heal. So somebody is trying to recover and heal over here. We have uh, should have taken the road less traveled. So somebody should have taken, you know, they thought they were on easy street or they were going to have it easy. Okay, but it, wheels turn, right? The karmic wheel. A fortune has turned around trying to seduce uh, seduce maybe somebody is trying to seduce you from uh, trying to seclude you from society friends and family and they're spying on you and they're trying to get into your dreams here yeah this karmic is broke this gold diggers broke no spiritual protection there is none if they had it before their ancestors turned away from them from all the all the nasty things they've been doing they don't have any the ancestors the ancestors gave up right Gave up trying to help them. They tried to help them. They tried to give them guidance to tell them which way to go. And this person didn't want to listen. So now they have no spiritual protection. So since this is a karmic cycle, um, pulled from there. Let's get some uh, letters here for you. Yeah, this person's really confused. Somebody could play, be playing with a Nintendo DS. Or Nintendo DS is a significant here. We got Uncle. Somebody can have problems with their dial tone. Or maybe your phone got shut off. Maybe you couldn't pay your phone bill. All right. We got Gemini. We got the number six. We got a Scorpio. All the things you said, all the things you said, running through my head, running through my head. Whatever that is for somebody that's running through their head, everything that they said or everything that you said to them. Somebody's got lies. So many lies over here. A Taurus, cousin, a niece, letter T. Yeah, stop messing with my throat, guys. They don't want me to talk. They don't want me to give this messages out. Let me get a drink. But you need to know what's going on, especially if this is your situation. And you're being scammed, especially if you are being scammed. An honest, upstanding individual would not want this to happen to them. And we don't have a whole lot of honest people out there in the world anymore, okay? People want to manipulate and they want to lie and they want to hold things in and hold back and not tell the truth, okay? And this is what we're here for, to help you guys, okay? Spread love, help people heal and tell the truth. 
And this is a love. This is a smooth criminal. Annie, are you okay? Are you okay? Are you okay, Annie? Annie, are you okay? Yep. All right, let's get uh, some initial, let's get some messages out of here for you. Somebody wants to know, Annie, are you okay? So I don't know what they're doing to Annie or, I don't know who, if it's, someone is named Annie, whatever, but maybe that's for you. Grandpa, um, we got a grandpa, we've got a female, we've got a grandma, we got a spouse, we got a past lover, an ex, an uncle, a niece, a son, a friend, and a cousin. For signs, we have Gemini, Sagittarius, Taurus, Libra, Scorpio, and we have fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sag. We have 68 or 86 could be significant. August or June could be significant. Selena. Something, somebody about selling, selling products here, productivity or production, some production. Somebody's into porn or porn production. Some, something's being scaled, weighed out. Cedric, somebody could be in the entertainment industry here. We got liars all around. People telling lies right to your face and just smiling like, I'm really your friend. Yeah. And they'll lie right to your face. Scott. Uh, there's a seer here involved. Could be a anybody that got that tarot reading. It could be a tarot reader here. Somebody could have welts on them that they don't know where they're coming from. They're like hives or welts have a wedge or somebody trying to uh, be a wedge or keep something wedged or some someone's trying to wedge something in between somebody's trying to uh somebody's in a race a race against time a race against another individual like a tortoise and a hare situation here trying to get to the finish line first about wide spaces or something's widened there's a wide range something with the range home on the range somebody's got some psychological issues here or is a uh, psychologically messing with someone Definitely less energy here, feeling less or getting less. Something with somebody's dresser, looking in the dressers, looking through the drawers. There, uh, there could be, somebody's house could be wired. There could be a, a microphone set up somewhere, so check that. Somebody could actually have wires on them to set somebody else up. Witted. You are you are smart witted. Tide is high, but I'm holding on. I'm gonna be your number one. So a uh, blondie over there, male or female? I was crying when I met you. Now I'm trying to forget you. Yeah. Aerosmith crier over here. Their lies are making them cry. Oh, there's some wicked energy over here. I hear ding dong, the wicked witch is dead, whatever that is. Somebody could be getting their last rites read to them. Or it's about, they could be getting their rights read, their Miranda rights, if they're getting arrested. Somebody made a bad deal. Huh. I hear that saying, she who smelt it, dealt it. So whatever that means for you. 
Someone could be seeing red or just angry right now, ready to lash out at someone. Someone is very unstable right now, very lewd, lucrative, and lewd. Somebody's screwed. Yeah, and scared. Screwed and scared. I got Edward, Eddie. Somebody could be going out west. I hear L or Ella. Rex, Rex is an effect, is an effect that I'm a wrecker. So somebody's a home wrecker. Diana, Dinah. Tessa, relinquish, what are we relinquishing? Something with the cell, the cell phone, or a cell, a jail cell. Somebody's worried about being in a jail cell, being caged up, caged in. Somebody could be riding a motorcycle or getting ready to leave on a motorcycle. Maybe somebody's buying a motorcycle. Like leather, leather and lace. Somebody's leathered or somebody's tied with leather. What What is this? Somebody could, may have passed away or is about to pass away here. So, like I said, this is just sad that somebody did this to their own life. But you, we can only put the messages out there to try and help individuals. You know, you have to do the help yourself. Someone's like, skeet, skeet, skeet. So somebody could be skeeting away. It's a setup. It's a setup, they said. Something's being leaked. All right, we have the number 68 or 86. We have S C R E D I T W L. First one, a last initial of you, your person, or anybody involved here. Take it as it resonates. It will not resonate with every single person out there. It's not going to be everyone's story so only take it if it resonates with you and you know this is what's going on or it sounds like your situation let's see somebody wants to feel brand new all right we have massachusetts new jersey california mrs uh i said mississippi but or i was about to missouri georgia so maybe mississippi significant too um Places that this is going on, places that you live, this person lives, places that this illegal activity is going on. So only take it what resonates and leave the rest, okay? Uh, South Dakota, Vermont, Hawaii, New Hampshire. Okay, I'm about to get out this energy over here now. New Mexico, because people be doing the dirty. All right, we have South Carolina, Rhode Island. We have Maryland, Colorado, and Wisconsin. Okay, let's go up North Carolina on the bottom. Massachusetts, South Dakota, South Carolina, New Jersey, Vermont, Rhode Island, Maryland, Hawaii, California, Missouri, New Hampshire, Colorado, Wisconsin, New Mexico, and Georgia. Okay, and then I said uh, North Carolina is on the bottom there. Could be significant to any of you. Okay, so take what resonates, guys. Leave the rest. I hope that... Uh, they did resonate. Like, comment, share, subscribe. I do appreciate all the, my supporters out there, all the love that you have for my channel. Thank you guys so much. And I hope you have a wonderful Wednesday. Happy hump day, guys. Take care.